you know, 15, 20 years ago. And yet, yeah, totally didn't view it as art, but people our age that saw what we were painting around the world, mm -hmm. you know, especially like London, New York, you know, uh, Brazil, yeah, all over really, you know, there were people out there that wanted to buy our stuff and wanted to kind of connect with us, but there was no kind of medium like middleman for them to do that mm -hmm. and you know we'd approach galleries and be like oh, are you interested in showing our work and they'd look at it see the fact that we'd used a can of spray paint and uh -huh. spray paint isn't art no not interested so because we come from this do-it-yourself kind of punky skateboarding attitude it's like fine we'll set up our own galleries we'll set up our own websites you know it worked incredibly well because the internet was kind of working it would have been so much harder without the internet mm -hmm. I don't know I don't know how artists survived without the internet but uh <coughs> so yeah we have this do-it-yourself attitude and um, you know i'm kind of a lot more firmly planted down in laguna nowadays and talking with adam he was like dude if you're down there then you know you should, you should we should find you a water paint and you know kind of run down you know run down neighborhoods in big cities you know people want you to paint stuff there uh -huh. because you know the council hasn't got the money to pay for it the business owner hasn't got the money to pay for it and they want something better on the side of their wall but you come to an affluent neighbor and you know city like this mm -hmm. and you know they're not as keen for you to do it and there are plenty of rules and regulations etc etc mm -hmm. that you have to go through to kind of get permission and I don't I personally don't know but my understanding is it can get it can take up to two years for you know you to get permission to paint a wall and we're just like I ain't got two years I don't know where I'm gonna be in two years <laughs> you know I could be living in Tokyo yeah. you know we spoke to the building owner the building owner loved what we did really super enthusiastic we're not writing anything offensive no. it's bright and happy you know it adds something to the environment it adds something to the community it adds something to the guy driving down the road to go and do his nine-to-five job it puts a little smile on somebody's face mm -hmm. and yeah and you know we funded this ourselves okay. and we did it and you know if the city comes to the conclusion that we've gone about it the wrong way or it doesn't fit in with their view of what they want Laguna to look like based on the fact they're all probably 60 odd years old then fine come down and paint over it it's paint <laughs> yep we even bought a brand new automatic sprayer for the event so we can call down all the papers yeah so it's you know it's paint right so it's, it's just paint, paint over it. that's all it is right. okay. it's paint. it'll take two people so hours. um um, so you guys weren't here when this. Uh, you, you mentioned that you were at the Wonder Wall. Um, so the, the landowner painted out that mural, and the city got all over him for painting it out. So it, I'm curious to see what what's going to happen when I make the phone call to ask them about, you know, what another Wonder Wall. <laughs> well, it's not that. It's, it's that you painted, I guess, without um, whether it's without authorization. You've got the owner's authorization. So yeah. I think that's what matters. I don't know. The city might have different, different views, but you're right. Okay, so you you've got permission from the people that matter. Yeah. Right. That's yeah. Right. Okay. You know, we're not we're not yeah. kind of, you know, we're not. We just make sure to call the right people at the right time to make things happen. Okay. Just like the other day, we called you, and that's why you're here. You know, and also think about how you got here. We gave you the wrong address. <laughs> <That's> true. <laughs> I guess I would have figured it out. Um, maybe. Um, I hear this. I'm listening for the spray paint. Yeah, no, you've heard me <laughs> rattling in the garden. <laughs> All right. So, Ben, tell me, tell me a little bit about the origin here. Um, uh, from my sense of it is that y your street art attempts to uh, attempts to pick up the vibe of the neighborhood. Yeah, like 